We're getting you some calls of the day now. Uh, our look at analyst upgrades and downgrades making waves. Uh, let's start with Adobe. Wells Fargo, the latest to take aim at the company, the bank cutting Adobe after it announced last week it would buy collaboration software specialist Figma for $20 billion. This deal has gotten a resounding thumbs down from analysts ever since it happened. Wells Fargo is really just the latest here. Edward Jones, Oppenheimer, Baird, Bank of America, Barclays have all downgraded the stock in response to this deal happening. Most of them are talking about the price being an issue. And the analyst over at Wells Fargo says, the product strategic fit is clearly aligned. It's the price tag that is likely to lend credence to the bear case, at least for now. The size of the deal leaves no room for error. I mean, this, <laughs> like, it, it's rare that you see um, so much agreement among analysts in response to something like this. Right. The entire street just shouting out, this ain't it, Adobe. Right. And, I or mean, at least even, and not, this, not at this price. Right. The total addressable market that Adobe was talking about of $16.5 billion by 2025 that Figma has expected to add $200 million in net new uh, annual recurring revenue this year and perhaps surpass $400 million by, um, by the end of 2022 and getting out of 2022. I think the entire street is just kind of looking at this deal and knowing in this entire kind of enterprise or broader cloud or collaboration suite, this application tool segment where there has been such a acquire to grow strategy from all of the brands and for, for how that has played itself out over years, it is remarkable for to, for the street to come together on a basis like this to your point and say, yeah, this, this wasn't the acquisition to do. Yeah. And the stock continues to slide here today after yeah. announcing that last week.